Hello guys, it's me Luke again and welcome to the Ernest the Chicken Quest Guide. To start this you need to come to Drain a Manor, which I will just quickly show you on the map. It is uh where let me just find Drain there we go, Drain a Manor. To get there you can come from Lumbridge, just go north, west, and then there you are. Uh you can go Varak, which you can go uh west and then south. You know, south of Barbarian Village and then it's just east. I think I got my correct. Sh I think I got it correct. There. So basically, when you're here, talk to Veronica, and she'll say, "Can you help me? I'm in trouble." Ah, sounds like a quest. I'll help. Um, ask for directions. Blah 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 blah. Just, just skip past all this. Basically, then all you have to do is run into the house. You know, watch out. There is a tree that smacks you somewhere back there, but don't need to worry about that. Um, climb upstairs. So yep. Got it to you, one sec. And then, sh I think it's up here. Yep. And he should be. There's the wacky professor. Be careful, and there's lots of dangerous equipment. I'm looking for a guy called Ernest. Ah, Ernest. Top notch bloke. Um, okay. Yep. Okay. Uh,. Change him back now. I'm glad Veronica didn't actually get engaged to a chicken. Oh, just change him back. The machine is broken and the gums have run out of the vial birds. Yeah, I'm missing a pressure gauge and a rubber tube there have been taken. Uh, my all cam, which is a needed. If things start again. So basically, we need to go find his stuff. So. The first one I am going to get is the oil can because it is the worst one ever. So, uh, I need to find how to get down to the basement. Oh, well, there's the rubber tube anyway. I can't just run and grab that. No, the door's been locked and there is a skeleton in there. What the worst time to forget my, you know, bloody armor. Um, the. If I remember rightly, I think. Oh, it's, I can't pull it. What oh, used to be thin. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, search bookcase. He's talking to Veronica, by the way, who usually would be sat there, but she's not there now, so. Yes. Right, what you want to do is when you're down here, the, the whole aim is you've got to go through all these doors in here to get through this one door here to get the oil can at the back. So, basically, what you do is. Pull lever A, then come over here and pull lever B. I think they said if you want to reset it, if this was ages ago as well. This one was about 2008 when I did this one. I think this, you could go upstairs and it reset everything. So, you know, I think he's. Oh, yeah, this is the one we can go through here. Oh. I'm really being crap now because I can't even click on anything. Um, and then we need to pull D. There we go. Pull D. Then go through the southwest door. Oh, wrong bloody door. Oh, we're well, good. I can go through this one again. Alright, and then you want to pull these two again. And uh, hopefully this should allow us to get up to the E and F ones. Right. Oh, oh don't attack the blue spider. Okay. So we should... So she attacks the spider anyway. Nice character. You just want to attack everything, don't you? Alright. Then you need to pull this... F lever and the E lever. And then go through here. Go through the second door. Pull the C lever. <laughs> and then back through these doors again. Back through this last door over here. 
and pull the E lever. There you go. Now just come back through this door and this door. This door. Hey presto, oil cam. There we go. Now we've got the oil cam. Now the rest is actually quite easy. Um, oop. There we go. Just go back upstairs. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for the the rubber tube now, um, which is going to should be quite easy. Should be quite easy. Um, there, there's the lever. Usually on the EOC one now, there is um, they've changed it so now there's like a little another candle thing there. So basically, you can just pull the candle light down. Don't know. I'd love something like that in real life. That'd be a beast. I mean, it's, it's having something like that. Um, but maybe again, that might just be me thinking that. Go in there. What are you doing? Where's that spade for that guy? There's a spade in here somewhere. There's the spade. And... Okay, go outside. We need to go outside. And the sh Go outside. And shide. There's a guillotine here. Or a gallows. If you've seen Pirates of the Caribbean, the uh... I think it's the third, fourth one, where all the people are getting hung. That's basically what one is. They hang people. Right, and you want to search the Kumpust. Search the Kumpust. That's a good way of saying it, isn't it, really? Sound like an idiot. All right, and then when you've got your key, uh, you're going to go back in. Now, you, if you're a low level, uh, I would watch out, and I probably would take food. As you can see. I am a low level, but for me, I am um, no care in the world because I, I really don't. I just I run in and I run back out. It's simple. I've got no worries about this skeleton. It seems to be dead. Oh, the tube is gone. Alright, I'll be right back, guys, because someone's nicked the tube. Alright, we, right, here we go. Use the key on the door. Grab the rubber tube. Get out. No trouble. Now, the last one we need to go upstairs. And then uh, go... There should be fish food around here. Somewhere, if I can see it from here. There. Just click take fish food. Now you gotta watch out for this bit because there's a lot of ghosts around. And because they're level 19, I don't know if they attack me or not. I think I may just be in luck. Yeah, I seem to be in luck. They don't seem to want to attack me anywhere. Don't worry about the chairs. They, they don't do anything. They just follow you around. Because uh, they're idiots. Obviously. And then uh, you need to go to the kitchen. Let's go to the kitchen. To the kitchen and get the poison. Who puts poison in the kitchen? Who knows? Oh well. And then the door shuts on me. Well done. Um, okay. Now, there's one thing about this place. You cannot leave through the front door. You always have to leave out the back door. Which is a pain in the ass, but there's nothing you can do about it. Now the whole reason you need fish food and the poison is because you've got to go poison the fish inside the uh, water fountain outside to get the pressure gouge. So yeah. So basically, what we're going to do is, while we're walking around, just click your, your poison, click on the fish food. Now you got poisoned fish food. Basically, inside that water, the water fountain, there is piranhas. Or I believe they're piranhas because they bite and they'll take some damage off you. Um, they might not be piranhas at all. They might just be fish that have mutated and they bite. I don't know. There's probably a lot of tropical fish in the world that do have teeth and will bite. Um, but yeah. 
basically just don't take no chances because it doesn't matter how many times you click on this you will never get through it uh, you just gotta put the fish food on it like that they start, oh there you go, the piranhas start eating the fish food and then they all die Oh, poor things, oh well give me the pressure gouge um, I actually, I'm actually fascinated by piranhas um, I know that sounds pretty weird but they're, just, they're quite cool so yeah, I mean, all most of the non-member quests, as you'll be able to see, because I've done quite a few now, um, they all last about ten minutes, if that. Except from that Doric's quest that lasted me two minutes. Not even that. I kind of Doric's. I kind of finished that, and that's probably the fa the fastest quest guide I've ever done, because it only lasted uh, what three uh, about thirty seconds, if that. If you've got everything with you, it takes about 30 seconds, if that, it won't take long. Um, you found everything, I have found everything, given me, yeah. Then he goes and puts them in there. And then his Ernest going to turn into a... Oh look, Ernest is back. Thank you, Millidit. Cash reward, thank you. There we go, 300 coins, 4 quest points. Bam, done and dusted. So if you like the Ernest and the Chicken Quest Guide, then you can always leave a like and a comment. I will be doing a lot more quest guys as you guys have heard me say a million times before. So leave a like and a comment and also subscribe if you want to watch more quest guys and other videos such as Tech It, Minecraft, uh, EOC which I do still do videos on and a lot of other stuff. So thanks for watching guys. It's been fun. It's been me Luke. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.